Хочу. Why have you summoned me? Uh, I apologize. I didn't mean to. You, Sherman Marsh, what is your bidding? Uh, bidding? Excuse me. <coughs> That's better. The interdimensional travel sometimes gets my throat all itchy. Are you the devil? I wouldn't go as far as the devil, more as a representative of the nether regions. Epic. There's a hierarchy, you know. I'm kind of like a regional manager. I have domain over those souls who place gum underneath their desks. So if you place gum underneath the desk, you... You're going straight to the underworld, where countless horrors will meet you. I've just seen some pretty cruel tortures. There's a Barney listening hour, the standardized test week, the dentist visit, and most unnatural, soul crushing of all, the Barbie listening hour. Oh, this is very educational. <coughs> but enough about me. Let's learn about you, Sherman Marsh. How's it going? Disastrous. Uh huh. Do you mind if I write down some notes? <coughs> I like to take notes. Shouldn't you be able to use your unholy powers? Of course. But no taking isn't one of them. Alright, so... You're not doing well. Everyone else is an idiot. And you feel superior to them? I am superior to them. Even better! What in particular distress you about the rest of humanity? The public school system is just churning out mindless drones whose only goal is to consume natural resources and gorge themselves on fast food. <laughs> right. It's doing its job. <laughs> oh, exactly. So when someone does show a glimmer of intelligence, crushed. Exactly. And you also have a, the hots for Amber Thompson. She's Marxy. I see. <laughs> well, those are some significant issues, but I'm not going to be able to help you. Okay. Just because I'm not actually THE devil, doesn't mean I can't do some pretty devilish things. I have some supernatural powers which might be able to assist you. Thank you. Such as, let me worry about that. Now, if I have the terms correctly, I think we can get a contract that can get you what you want in no time. You can ride out of here in a fancy new life. I don't want a new life, I want a better life. Right, right. But let's try this on for science. Let's say you wake up in the morning, you flex your toned legs, look in the mirror, sweep at the flowing blonde hair of yours, the gorgeous blue eyes, get ready for the new day, and you look good <laughs> in your clothes. You're able to wear those little short shorts that look really nice on you. Pardon me. <laughs> your boyfriend picks you up in Red Thunderbird. His name is Chip. He works for an investment bank. He buys you an expensive dress that you take vacations to only together. Wait, but I'm a girl? Yeah. See. Wait. Okay. No, we've never done that. <laughs> <laughs> what, what am I supposed to do? <laughs> 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 <laughs>